Hello everyone, my name is Greg and I will show you how to refuel in the gas. First of all, we have to take all appropriate PPE from the truck, which is located side of the truck in here. You have to put the visor pro properly. Take the cryogenic gloves and make sure all the windows and that box is closed. Before you start refueling, make sure you've got long trousers and long sleeves on you. Now you can put the gloves, gloves on. First of all, remove safety cap from the tank and attach the earth cable to the truck. The next step is take the air gun and clear all the debris from the sun. Afterwards, you have to take main valve and also make sure that it's free from debris and ice inside. Next step is attach main valve to the tank, twist it and close it up. Now we need to open the vent valve. So now we can move to this side of the tank when is the main screen to start refueling. To start doing this, you have to make sure you've got your key from the truck because you're going to be need your ham card to activate the whole the process. So you have to open the door by pressing the green button, follow the instruction on the screen, press the enter, enter, attach the payment card, and press OK. Approve, and you can start filling the tank. Remember to close the door by pressing the red, red button, and now we can go to the end of the tank. All what you have to do right now is just press start Volvo button. All the procedure will be start automatically and will finish automatically as well. You may have to keep the eye on the station all the time. In the case the alarm will go off, you may have to press the dead man, sw dead man switch to continue refueling. In the case if you've got big leak from the tank, you may have to press also emergency button to stop refueling. After the process is finished, you can remove the nozzle from the tank. Make sure you close the uh, vent valve. After when you remove, make sure it's free from ice and place back to the tank. Take off the earth cable and put the cup back into the tank. That's the end of the LNG refueling. Make sure you put back all the PPE on the side of the truck for the next driver.